Welcome everybody to Let's Play Pixel Junk Shooter 2. We are going to play two-player co-op here. And uh, we're going to do something new here. On the Let's Play PC channel, I usually play just PC games. But right now, we're going to play this game. I love this game. I'm going to play it with my four-year-old son here. I'll we'll press start. We we'll press start. We've got our two ships here. We've played through the first one and this one a bunch of times, so we're gonna get we're gonna get as many diamonds and rescue as many dudes as we can. So here we go. We're starting off. Going into the first area. This is actually chapter four because it's to be continued from the first one. So we get dropped into this acid here and we've got acid covering us. We gotta go wash it off. Or else it'll eventually eat through and eat the ships and we'll die. Is this another diamond? Get that one. Here comes a couple bad guys. I'm not seeing a wall. Now, if you uh, if you played the first one and you haven't played this one, one of the big additions they made was the spin attack that you can use. And we just got a trophy for using it. Just got a diamond there. Oops, I am covered in acid, and I need to get to the water here pretty fast. Actually, there's a diamond at the bottom. Don't go there yet. Don't go there yet. At least I think there's a diamond. Let me go look down here. Is there a diamond or did I already get it? I already got it, didn't I? Okay, I better go wash off. I might die here. Oh, just got there in time. We'll go to the next area. I think we got all the diamonds in that area. Now for this next one... Those things are going to get you pretty much no matter what, so you've got to go. Actually, I'm thinking of a different area. Never mind. But if you wanted to, you could totally avoid getting sprayed by those things. And just killed a few water bug creatures. Those things can be a little bit annoying, but sometimes you will appreciate having them around because they release water when you, when you kill them. Let's go get in the water here. Wash off. There's a spin attack. You need to learn how to use that spin attack if you're playing this for the first time. It's very useful. I don't think there's a secret area down there. Let's get washed off. Hey, I can't go up. Yeah, you can go up. Well, you can keep getting stuck on the walls there. When you get to, when you touch these walls, when they look like this, then you get stuck for a second, and it's kind of annoying. You get stuck, and acid comes out. So let's rescue a good guy here. And if I'm not mistaken, there's a diamond next. Yep. And there's, a diamond right there. there's another good guy. And there's a diamond. Yep, there's a diamond in this next thing. Now, when we go up here to leave, the acid's going to squirt on us and the door is going to slam shut. So we're going to have to come back and wash off. You cannot go to an exit with acid on you. The, acid, the exit will slam shut. See, watch this. Bump. That's kind of annoying, especially the first time you play this game. You're like, how the hell did I get out of here? There we go. Exit's back open again, but we've just got to make sure we don't uh, we don't go through this little area while it's squirting. So let's hold up until it's done. Now we can go. Oh, jeez. I found my acid. Yep, now we've got to go wash off. And the yellow ship. He is the green ship, as you can probably tell. Okay, let me just go through, and you stay here. Okay, that that works perfectly. Thank you. Okay. Oh, here are some water bug guys. Now you gotta be careful when you use that spin attack, because sometimes you come out of it right next to an enemy, and then the enemy runs into you and you die. So you have to be a little bit careful using that thing. And here's one of the big ones that splits into three little guys when you kill them. Maybe it's two. Let's go down here. Oops, I lost track of which guy I was. That happens to me a lot. There's, I think this is a, oh no, that's a diamond, not a shield. And here's a good guy. 
Here's a lava turtle or whatever that thing is. Oh. Gotta be really careful not to shoot the good guys when you're trying to kill the bad guys. And in this game, they love to put the bad guys in place where you can shoot the good guys instead, and it's really annoying. This is actually a really hard game. At least when you play it the first time. We've played it so many times that it's not hard anymore. Play let's uh let's get rid of all this rock. Oh, there's a diamond. Don't oh yeah, don't go to the exit yet. We're gonna get out the I've diamonds got here. Diamond. Okay, there's probably one more. I think there is one more down here at the bottom. I might be wrong about that. There's one right here. Yep, here's one. So we've gotten probably all of them here. Let's go to the exit. Yep. It's next to impossible to get all the diamonds your very first playthrough because they don't tell you whether you've gotten them all until you get to the end. Now, the second time you play through on every screen, they'll tell you whether there's any diamonds left. So that makes it way easier because that way you know to keep searching if you haven't found any. So there's a the flag guy. Dead. We got one-ups. We don't need one-ups, though, because we're not losing good guys. Oh, got the fly guy. Would you take a look at this beautiful digestive tract? The, this beast can drink molten metal like a milkshake. And the gaseous properties in this sludge takes on when it evaporates? Astounding! As a biologist, getting eaten by a life form of this complexity is a, indeed a rare opportunity. Wonderful. I got a diamond there. All right, and is there a secret area in the bottom of this place? I don't think there is, but the, the diamond. Like, yeah, that's not like some diamond. Okay, there's there might be one up here. Yep, there's one. Got it. Oh, now let's go to the exit. And I think there's one more down here. Is there one more down here? Oh, you're right. There is. Good job. The, the Good what? job. I know. I know this still was. All right, this is the last area of this uh, this stage, stage one of chapter, well, it's actually chapter four, even though it's the first chapter of this game. Now, there is a secret area right here, and there's two diamonds in this secret area. So we just got those. And is there a diamond here? Yep, there is. Why don't you get that one, bud? Good job. Let's shoot the water sack and the bad guy there. Water turns bubbles into acid. And that's not exactly necessarily an improvement because acid is more dangerous, although bubbles do make you spin. So it's kind of up to you whether to decide that's uh, more dangerous. Anyway, here you've got to avoid the acid that comes down every time the water shoots up. And here's going to be some acid shooter guys. These guys are a pain. These guys really are a pain. Exit's open. Okay, I got everybody here. I think. Come back over to the left. I want to see if there's a diamond over here. And yeah, there isn't, so never mind. Do I need a drop of water? I need some water. There we go. Where? Uh, or did we get all the diamonds in this area? I think we might have. We probably did. Uh, I'm not seeing any more. Looks like we've gotten a perfect rescue as well. It can be kind of hard to get that in every one of these. Look out for the water bug. There's a water bug up there. Yeah, there we go. You got both of them. And they released water and we washed ourselves off with it. Oh, okay. You're right. It's not. I'm gonna get to the exit. Okay, you get to the exit. Not me. All right, come on over. And these bubble things, the best thing you can do to control your ship is grab one of those, whatever those wheels, so that you can spin around them and then let go at the right time, and you'll fly off on a tangent to where you were spinning. 
and hopefully get to where you need to go. I think we got all the diamonds there. Let's see. I think there are 20. Yes, we did get all the diamonds. Sweet! So, in the next episode of this Let's Play, we will play the next, next stage. We're going to go to the, if you want to make an omelet stage. So, we will see you in the next stage.